step to Christ, what to do with doubt. The Apostle Paul says that God has delivered us from the power of darkness and hath translated us into the kingdom of his dear Son. Colossians 1 verse 13 And everyone who has passed from death unto life is able to set to his seal that God is true. John chapter 3 verse 33 He can testify, I needed help, and I found it in Jesus. Every want was supplied, the hunger of my soul was satisfied, and now the Bible is to me the revelation of Jesus Christ. Do you ask why I believe in Jesus? Because he is to me a divine savior. Why do I believe the Bible? Because I have found it to be the voice of God to my soul. We may have the witness in ourselves that the Bible is true, that Christ is the Son of God. We know that we are not following cunningly devised fables. Peter exhorts his brethren to grow in grace and in the knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. 2 Peter 3 verse 18 When the people of God are growing in grace, they will be constantly obtaining a clearer understanding of His Word. They will discern new light and beauty in its sacred truth. This has been true in the history of the church in all ages, and thus it will continue to the end. The path of the righteous is as the light of dawn that shineth more and more unto the perfect day. Proverbs 4 verse 18 by faith we may look to the hereafter and grasp the pledge of God for a growth of intellect, the human faculties uniting with the divine, and every power of the soul being brought into direct contact with the source of light. We may rejoice that all which has perplexed us in the providences of God will then be made plain, things hard to be understood will then find an explanation, and where our finite minds discovered only confusion and broken purposes, we shall see the most perfect and beautiful harmony. Now we see through a glass, darkly, but then face to face, now I know in part, but then shall I know, even as also I am known. 1 Corinthians 13, verse 12 Step to Christ, pages 112 and 113.